Good morning. It is my first morning in my new place. I have a lot of boxes on this side. I'm sitting on my mattress and there's my bed frame. <laughs> so it is about 9.15. I know I have groceries like Amazon Fresh coming between 11 and 1 today. And then I don't think there's anything else coming today. I know I have like HelloFresh coming Monday and whatnot tomorrow. It's about 9.15. I slept so well last night. I just slept on my mattress on the floor because absolutely not was I going to be building a bed frame last night. I was so tired. Um, but I have Amazon Fresh coming at 11. Well, 11 to 1, but as soon as 11. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of get ready and we're going to walk down to Target because I don't have a trash can. My last place had like a trash valet service, so they provided the trash can. So I don't have a trash can here and that's kind of a priority that I need. So let's go ahead and get ready and walk down to Target. Okay, I brushed my hair, put on this and put on moisturizer. That's as far as we got today. I think that's pretty good. I definitely lack the understanding of how sun is supposed to be here. So, we'll see if this apartment actually gets sunlight. It may not. <laughs> in this building that I'm in, only this and one other um, unit was available during my time. But the other unit was like six, seven hundred more. So, that's why we're here. I know I had made a couple of videos where I included like, oh, I'm going on a tour or some whatever, like apartment hunting. Um, but then I kind of stopped. I didn't include anything of when I came out to this area and toured like seven. It was crazy, but it was really hard. Like I, in general, I just, I thought I would have more options. No, absolutely not. And I know moving during the summertime is very hard, um, but holy smokes. There was like, oh, during that window you need, like these two weeks, yeah, you have like one unit available. Like in each of the buildings I was looking at. So it was it was a nightmare. So I'm glad at least like this place had an option that like fit my budget and all my wants and needs, but holy smokes. Wow. Okay. I'm ready. I got my purse. Up, really the keys over there. Some Let's some go to Target. Step three. Grow hard about what you want to be. Step four. Fuck everybody just do your thing. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 Yeah. Okay, I just got back. I think the last clip I had was I don't like these trash cans. And I didn't. The one I wanted was like a 30 gallon one. It was 30 bucks. But then I was thinking how in this space, like, where would I put a trash can that I wouldn't like hate it? I don't love the idea of someone walking into my apartment and the first thing they see is a trash can. Like I have this little like thing here and I feel like that could go there, but it's just kind of like right there. So I was like, maybe I actually shouldn't be getting a taller 30 gallon trash can and I should just get a small one to put under my sink. So that's what I did. I basically bought a, a mini version of it. <laughs> um, I think this is only like 3.1 gallons or something. And then that means I had to, I had to buy new uh, trash bags, beachside breeze. Okay. And then um, I got another drying mat because I got rid of my old one. It was definitely, it, it served its purpose. And the last thing I got, which you're gonna be like, why are you so excited? Grapes. Because I have not had grapes in way too long because I'm very particular about my grapes. They have to be like crisp and if they're not like I will not eat them and I got one of these it was just in their like you know cheap section because I don't really need a lap 
desk. But what I'm thinking is that could be good as a placeholder until I figure out how I want to go about a dining situation. So until then, this is what we're doing. Just having like a hard surface I could eat on while I sit on the couch or on my bed or whatever. Um, yeah, that is my update. Okay, we made a little progress in the last 15 minutes. I basically, I put my couch together like this and I just removed one section. That way, hear me out, I have that whole space to get some dining situation because this place does not come with an island and I would like to get something that could be of use like that. It's probably hard to see it now because my bedroom is absolutely so cluttered at the moment, but that extra piece that I didn't put with my couch will actually fit really well um, in my bedroom for now, but ultimately my apartment complex has storage units that I think I will ultimately get because I just have stuff and stuff I don't necessarily need all the time, but I don't need to get rid of it. Um, and I want to be able to keep that stuff, but not just have it cluttered in this small space. But I'm feeling good about just getting this couch together and seeing, like, I do not need that big of a couch for this space. So it's good to kind of just make it smaller. Having a modular couch is literally so clutch. Okay, we have finished the kitchen. Holy smokes. At least I think so. I feel like we generally try to put all the kitchen boxes in the kitchen and I don't think there was anything I noticed like where are those at. Um, so I have these two boxes here. One actually has a trash bag in it, but those two are full of things that I want to put in a storage unit. So whenever I get back from my trip, I will like kind of better sort that stuff out, but I figure it's probably better now to kind of organize the stuff that I know I do not need with me now and would like to have in a storage unit. So that is for the kitchen. I'm glad to have that done because the kitchen is the easiest to kind of organize and put away. Next up is my bedroom and I'm not looking forward to that one, but that is a problem for after Amazon Fresh is delivered. I think that's um, being delivered shortly. So I'm taking a break until then. I, I know I look absolutely stunning right now. Okay, I know. So moving past that, I put together my bed and I did not, like I haven't been filming any um, time lapse because I don't want to waste my time doing that if I have to redo everything. So there's a lot of like, oh, let me put this in this cabinet. Oh wait, that's not gonna work. So I don't wanna deal with that. And same with my bed. I did not know if that was gonna go well. I've never had to put together a bed, like screwing in all the different, like, what would that be? Like, the proper stuff to handle the weight of the bed, you know, all that. Like, I have never just had to do that myself. Usually, it's, I've always had help or someone else with a drill. So, it's me with a drill balancing and doing it all. And I feel really strong and independent. I can tell you that. <laughs> but, here it is. Okay. So, I thought that I would have to have the head of the bed against that window because I thought the length of this would be too long with these doors. I did not think I would have the ability to walk through at all. So very glad about that. And then I have all this space over here. I didn't center it. I purposely moved it over so that I could have this space. So one, ultimately, I think I'll get a desk. Two, in the meantime, like these are all closed. I will unpack them shortly. But remember, I have this extra piece to my couch. So for now, it's going to actually go in that space perfectly. Okay, I'm gonna continue watching the basketball game and then tackle my clothes, but also probably put the stuff under my bed that I plan to put under my bed. Okay, so the first step of getting all my clothes put away is I decided to just take them out of all the boxes I knew that were labeled clothes. And so I just put them all on my bed. And I have one box here that is really just like full of all the drawers that are like, you know, socks, underwear, athletic clothes, all that stuff. So I have everything out and I purposely left some things like on the ground stacked together that I want to vacuum seal and either put in um, the storage or be able to put under my bed. I don't know yet, but progress. Um, this is my closet, honestly. It is a really good size. Here it is. 
It is a really good size. So I'm gonna show you with all the clothes in there. Okay, two things. One, I see I actually do get some sunlight that comes in here. Like, that's pretty nice. I'll love to see just how much actually comes in. Two, I finished. So, this is it for now. I'm continuing to go through stuff and then put stuff aside that I want to either put in vacuum bags or just generally put in a box for storage, whatever. But that's been very helpful. So, I think my closet is done for now. That's pretty amazing. I have boxes to break down, but I'm feeling pretty good. I'm literally going to change into not jeans and just lay on my bed and breathe for a moment. Cause that is what I need. Okay. Okay, what is it? Like six o'clock. I don't know the last update I gave. I know it's just like the fact that I was going to be chilling out and I was tired. Um, and that is the case. I think I finished the basketball game that was on. And then you'll be happy because I finally edited a video. <laughs> um, I edited the video of basically my last week in my old apartment and just kind of like wrapping up stuff and then getting ready for the move and wrapping it up um, the day of the move. So that is what I just finished editing. It is 31 minutes. That's definitely the longest video I've ever put out, but I'm so fine with it. I personally love long videos. Like I love watching people's vlogs and when it's very like unedited and very just like, I don't know, raw. I enjoy that because I feel like I'm just literally like hanging out with someone and I'm like, oh, you know, I'm just like going along with them and whatever they're doing. I, don't, I like those and I will just like turn those on while I'm doing other stuff or cleaning, um, eating, whatever it is. Like those types of videos I live for. If someone uploads like a 12 minute vlog, I'm upset. I'm not going to lie. Like I'll be like, man, like especially my, my favorite YouTubers. I'm like, <sighs> but the moment it's like 20 or more. I'm the happiest. I've been snacking on my grapes while I've been in bed. If you heard that crack, that was my wrist. <laughs> um, but I need to stop because grapes are one of those things. Grapes and watermelon. I will just sit there and eat and eat and eat. If it's in front of me, like I will eat. I mean, that's with a lot of food. But I will become like disgustingly full from grapes and watermelon because I just, they're so addictive. I don't know what it is about them. Good morning. It is obviously the next day and it is before 8 a.m. It's like 7.52. Guys, I don't know if you can hear in the background, there's construction going on. It's killing my soul because technically today's Monday and I have today off for a federal holiday. Um, and it woke me up at like 6.30 this morning and that just kind of hurt a lot. <laughs> I was too lazy to get up and go find like earplugs or something, but yeah, so I'm up. Um, and right now I'm working on uploading that video because I don't know if I, I don't think I said it yesterday, but I've been really struggling to get this to export out of Final Cut. So that sucks and I'm working on it. Hopefully I will get that resolved today, but um, that's what I'm doing. And then between nine and 11, my Wi-Fi person is supposed to come and like set everything up. So kind of just waiting on that. So I guess he could come as soon as the next hour. Um, and then today I also have my HelloFresh finally being delivered. So very excited about that because then I'll have legitimate meals. I just wanted to update you, say good morning. I'll probably carry this vlog throughout today and we'll wrap it up. Okay, so the Wi-Fi guy just got here. He's doing his thing, trying to find whatever he's needing to find in the building. Um, okay, I just got back. One second, This it is too hot. I checked the temperature this morning and it showed like 
low 60s. So I was like, oh, okay, I need a hoodie and I'll be comfortable. Wrong, it's now hot outside. Okay, um, yesterday I realized I had no paper towels. I thought I had like one roll, um, like in a box somewhere. Did not, but the clip you saw was me leaving to go to Target. I went there for three things. I went there to get body lotion, a beach bag, like to be able to like actually take onto the beach and more of a mom beach bag than like a cute little teen beach bag. You know, there's a difference. Um, that and then a pair of shoes I was getting for my boyfriend for this trip. They had them on Amazon, but I was seeing if they had like a similar pair at Target. I came out of there with the lotion, no beach bag, no shoes. <laughs> now you may be wondering, JC, your bag's still full. I did get the lotion though, but let's keep that in mind. Yay. The last things I got were not fun by any means, like, no. Um, I got some more toothbrushes and some more toothpaste. And then I got a new shower liner. I got a, um, this clear one, but then this is also a liner, but it's white and opaque. And what I'm thinking is actually just having this be my shower curtain. I need a new liner anyways. Like I need it. It's been a year. I think you're supposed to replace them a lot more frequently than a year, but I guess they're vacuuming the hallway. Sorry about that. But I got some of that. So it's like not fun stuff. And then I came back and I had my HelloFresh delivered. So I got two what would be considered like, you know, dinner entrees. They both look freaking phenomenal. And then I got two what they consider their lunches. So I got these as well. Oh, oh. They sent me two of this, but I think the fourth meal is actually different. We'll find out. Oh, and the um, barbecue ranch pulled chicken wraps. That's that's the fourth one that they didn't have to send the photo of. All right, I'm gonna put this up away. So I just got back from work. Um, I went ahead and stopped in the office. Today is actually a holiday for us. It was an observed holiday for Juneteenth, for Monday, June 20th. So my um, office did have off. I did still have work that I needed to do for like other contracts and such that they weren't taking today off. Um, and unfortunately, satellites don't take the day off. So there's always stuff going on in space. Um, so I just went to the office and was helping my coworker with some other stuff and doing my own work. So I just got home and it's 8.30. It's actually a very long time. Um, I think I went in there around like 11.30 or 12 or something like that. So it was a long, exp oh my gosh. Wait, that's like an eight hour day. So I just realized like I just worked a full day. Like I'm used to working this late, unfortunately, but just the way my days are, it's just kind of different. So I, wow, okay. Um, I actually still have some more work to do, so that kind of sucks, um, but I'm okay with it. It's just like, dang it, because now I can't just like mentally clock out, but um, I'm going to go ahead and like kind of tidy up. I made a little mess when I got back from Target and such, and I'm going to figure out if I want to eat anything. Um, we had a lunch, like me and my coworker and another co coworker was there that I didn't realize was going to be there. So we went out and grabbed something for lunch after I was done with my meeting. Um, it's kind of later and it's like very heavy. So I'm just not sure if I'm really hungry for anything. And if I am probably just like a snack. So I'm going to gather myself. I'm going to gather myself. I'm going to change, chill, bust out my laptop again. Okay. It has been a few hours. I've just been working <laughs> more. Um, I did set up my projector, so I have that going. I do have this light on right now just to end this clip though, so it's not as like, you know, crisp and whatnot, but I am tired. I'm going to bed shortly, so this video is complete. 
So thank you for joining this long if you did, and I will see you in my next one.